Well, it began with a straddle injury uh, that smashed about an inch and a half of my urethra while I was building a house in Idlewild, California. Uh, we called a local doctor and he came and uh, recognized that it was a serious problem and recommended that I go to an uh, emergency room in LA, which we did that night. There was uh, bleeding at the, you know, that was coming out of the penis at that time. Well, the process was uh, trying to figure out whether they could uh, reopen the uh, urethra, but that was not a, a viable uh, solution, so they ended up having to uh, go through a reconstructive surgery. And I went through a number of operations for reconstructive surgery, and including skin graft. Well, it was it was a pretty painful and uncomfortable experience, and uh, it was just you had to be rather patient to uh, to go through the various stages of the operations to to get squared away. But the the main thing that followed the uh, reconstructive surgery after that was completed was a series of strictures that went on for a number of years. And uh, that was almost one per year, sometimes two per year. And they were mostly emergency situations regarding having hospital stays. So it was, it was a long, drawn-out experience. Well, I guess the toughest part was just going through the long years of of having stricture after stricture and uh, being discouraged with it. That was a, a tough part, uh, dealing with it, because it seemed like it was gonna be endless. And, well, fortunately, I had a very supportive wife, and she took me to the hospitals and brought me home and did all the driving and, and took good care of me uh, in the process through all of these uh, surgeries, which probably uh, totaled something like 20 surgeries all from the time from the beginning to the end. Uh, one of the desperation solutions was to install a urethral stent. And uh, that turned out to be a failure. And uh, so when that failed, uh, the doctor recommended that I see uh, Dr. Joel Gelman, who was a stricture specialist at UCI, UCI Medical Center. And he uh, surveyed the situation and decided that he could successfully uh, remove the stent and uh, hopefully put me back into normal. And uh, so it was scheduled and uh, this stent was removed in a long, about six and a half, seven hour surgery and about a five day hospital stay and since that time, uh, I've had no strictures. I've had the, most of my plumbing problems are just about absolutely normal. And I'm eternally grateful to Dr. Gelman for his uh, skill and knowledge. So I have a lot of respect for him personally, and I consider him a, a friend.